third in our series on, uh, on, the, on Muslim minorities in Asia. Uh, we've been exploring not just a geographical spread, so we've had so far uh, uh, Drew Gladney who spoke on China, uh, and Bajahat Habibullah and Rakesh on India. And on next week, on the 23rd, we will uh, host um, uh, Professor Joseph Leo from uh, Nanjing uh, Technological University in Singapore. And he'll be talking on Muslim minorities in Thailand and the Philippines. We will, after this series gets completed with uh, Joseph's talk next week, uh, be uh, publishing uh, the excellent papers that all of them have written as an APOC publication, hopefully by the end of the year. So coming to Professor Basant's talk, uh, Professor Basant is so multidimensional that it's really hard to introduce him in a minute. Uh, he's an economist by training, has involved himself uh, in India's most presti prestigious uh, management institute, uh, the Indian Institute of Management, Ahmedabad. I say that even though I'm from a competitor, I am Calcutta, which often claims to be number one, but it isn't. Um, so I am Ahmedabad. Um, where he is a professor, he's the chairperson of the Center for Innovation, Incubation, and Entrepreneurship. He coordinates a small and medium enterprise program. Uh, so he's done that earlier. He spent time, has done very good work on, on higher education. And in fact, that is where we have interacted uh, quite a bit. And it turns out that uh, as an economist and a statistician, uh, his services were recruited, and uh, apart from his general passion on this topic, to look at the issues of Muslims in India. So when the Prime Minister created the Sachar Committee, which was the, the has become sort of the main database now for devising policy regarding uh, Muslim upliftment in India, uh, Rakesh joined that uh, committee as a member. And uh, a lot of uh, the, the socioeconomic analysis, the statistical work, uh, is due to his efforts. So that was uh, a reason we also had a good discussion, and he's since then done work on how things have changed since Sachar, because the government put in place uh, several initiatives, and he's going to talk about that. He, you, you can, if those who came to Wajahat's talk would be able to then compare this work, which looks at socioeconomic status, with Wajahat's presentation, which looked at political status. And the idea was to complete that in this important area of the world. Uh, so with that, uh, let me uh, hand over to Rakesh with a warm welcome. 